Sachin sold his bet at 10% loss to Rahul. After some time, Rahul sold the same bet to Dinesh at 25% loss. If Dinesh paid 135 rupees for the bet, what is the purchase price of the bet for Sachin? So there are three people. Sachin is selling the bet to Rahul and Rahul is selling to Dinesh. So let us make up. So let us start like this. So here you have Sachin. Sachin. Then you've got Rahul. And then you've got Dinesh. Okay. So yeah, let us start. Uh, let us say Rahul, Sachin got it for the bet for rupees 100. Okay, so we'll say let the price, okay, let me write like this. Uh, let the cost price, so this is Sachin Rahul Dinesh. Let me change color. So this is for Sachin, the cost price is say 100 rupees. He's making a loss of 10%. So the selling price for Rahul Sachin is 90 rupees. And that is the cost price for Rahul. So the cost price for Rahul is 90 rupees. Now he is selling at a profit at a loss of again. This is 10%. He's making a loss of 25%. So 25% is a quarter. And a quarter is a half of a half. So so 25%, so let me show that, 25% of 90 is 22.5. Uh, so how did I know that? Because half of 90 is, half is 50%, so 50% is 45 rupees. So 25% would be half of 45, which is 22.5. So for him, for Rahu, the selling price is 90 take away 90.0 take away 22.5 so uh, this is uh, the selling price would be so this is 89 and I'm using the algorithm so this is 0.5 and this is 67.5 okay and the selling price for Dinesh is so you can see the cost price for Dinesh is rupees 67.5 or in other words Dinesh is paying 67.5 to Rahul okay so we started with 100 so now we can say now we can say uh, let us find let us uh, uh, write the cost price for Rahul the CP of CP cost price for Rahul let us make two tables or two columns. So this is the cost price for Dinesh. And uh, this is the purchase price, PP. All right. This is also PP to make a difference. PP is purchase price for Sachin. So can I say if the cost price or the purchase price for Dinesh is 67.5, the cost price or the purchase price for Sachin is 100 rupees. This is rupees and this is also rupees. But in reality, how much is Dinesh paying? Dinesh is paying 135 rupees. So if Dinesh is paying 135 rupees, how much is the uh, purchase price for Sachin? Now this is, if you look at these two numbers, so you have to can you find a number which goes so 67 how many times 67 makes 135 so 60 plus 60 is 120 okay so 60 plus 60 is 60 plus 60 is 120 and 7.5 plus 7.5 is 15 so this is 135 so we can see if you look at the numbers closely you can see this 135 is 2 times or 67 times 2 is 135 so this 
you have to multiply with the same number or the same proportion or same factor so you can say the purchase price so pp purchase price for sachin was 200 rupees was 200 rupees so it's always good to check whether the answer that you've got is right so let us check now so this is a check we're checking whether our answer is making sense so sachin started with 200 he paid 200 and he is selling at a loss of 10 percent so if you take 10 percent of this this is 20 so he is selling it for rupees 180 okay now this is sachin this is rahul and again that same bat is sold at a loss of 25 percent okay so 25% is a quarter, so half is 90 and half of 90 is 45. So 180 minus 45 is 135. So our working is right and we should be proud of our answer. So let us give ourselves five stars.